Good morning folks, this is Jason Good with the Good Life Outdoors. Out here at Little Bay again here in Rockport and about to go out and go fishing again. So last time I was out here, caught a big old redfish first thing in the morning before work. Thought I'd try to go do that again. So stick around, we'll see what happens. Alright, got a little red fish. Alright, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. I'm not gonna keep you, but I am going to look at you. Nice, hey little guy. You gave yourself away. Uh oh. Saw some action in the water, threw toward it, and sure enough, a little red fish. Bite it kind of turned off for a little bit there. This cloud cover moved in. It's like a little squall line. All right. Haven't been completely skunked today, that's a good thing. Gotta skip that gold spoon across the top of the water. Make it look like a, a bait fish trying to escape. Oh, a little bump. Feeding there, I'm right in the middle of them. Just the trick of finding them. Go down with a little bit, get this knot out of my line. <laughs> right at the boat and it's a keeper trap. <laughs> Woo! Hey. Nice. Alright. Alright, come here, come here. Alright. A little too wild, a little too green. I'm gonna get the net for him. Cause this one I may take home and get some lunch if I can't keep my uh, tackle box out of there. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Wow, hey buddy. Oh goodness, let's make a mess all over my boat, okay? Oh yeah, let's grab my grab my pliers. Let's get this line wrapped everywhere. Thanks, buddy. Really appreciate the, the help with that one. For that I think I am gonna keep you. Alright. There we go. That all sorted. Oh, come on. I really don't want to get a get that in my foot right now. So the grippers. Gotcha. Let's get this out of your mouth. Let's take a look at you. All right, 
nice nice size trout there what do, we, what do you measure what do you measure in here oh did i just do that no okay get that out of the water just grab it that could be bad make all the noise in the world all right where are you buddy all right you are a good 18 inch 18 inch trout i won't complain about that no sir all right just wondering what i was gonna have for lunch today this is what i'm having for lunch today fry you up and eat you Ooh, something went after it. Try that again, see if I can. Oh, there we go. Oh, goodness. Something hit it and missed it the first time. Second time, he came back and got it. Good size red. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. All right. Love gold spoon, man. I catch everything on a gold spoon. It's not giving away a secret, it's just what it is. All right, buddy. You about ready to be got? Because I think you're about ready. Cool. All right, come here. I don't think I'm going to keep you because I already got a nice trout and I have some fish tacos in mind, but I am going to put a measure on you because you are a keeper. You also got something weird going on with your mouth. I'm not sure about that. I'll get you. No, 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 no. Come back over here. I'm going to flip you out of the boat. Oh, self-release. Never mind. Shite. Don't flip you in the boat. Oh, big old pot of mullet behind me. Oh, goodness. Bouncing off mullet with this spoon here. Some activity in the water over here, let's see. It's one of the things I like to do, see these pods of mullet, may not even be chased, but they're there and usually the bait fish, I'm sorry, the other fish are around, so I'll just pull my lure right through the middle of those mullet. A lot of times I'll get hit by something other than mullet. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> what is this? Oh, <laughs> got an oyster. Must be shallow right there. Oh, felt like something attacked it. Alright. I have caught trout, a couple of redfish, and an oyster. It's a good day on the water. <laughs> Little trout. Looking for something to chase. And he chased my gold spoon. There you go, buddy. <laughs> All right, something chasing over here on this reef. I'm trying to get over to it. Lots of mullet.
Oh. <laughs> All right, I'm in the middle of something. Tell if I'm just bounced off mullet or something, or actually attacking my spoon. But definitely a lot of mullet around. Head shaker, and a little trout. Nice. Okay, I'm not gonna try to do the boat flip again because that didn't work so well last time. But okay, 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 okay. Yeah. okay, I've already got one, so I'm not gonna keep another one. But this is pretty cool. I'm just. Catching trout like crazy. Let's get you measured. Oh, nope, no, nope, don't. Nope. Back on that. There you go. Get my grips on you. Since you're not behaving. Alrighty. Alright, a little 16 incher. Alright, buddy. Thanks for the fight. Let's go out there and get bigger. Bye, guy. Cool. What kind of stuff makes you want to get up in the morning. It's getting about the time I need to go to work. Leave the fish biting like this. I have to just kind of go along the way because I do need to get going. I do have to get paid for actually working as opposed to coming out here and fishing. grab that. That has been the ticket today. A little honeycombed gold spoon. And they seem to like it. Especially in the middle of all these little pods of mullet. Well, another great morning of fishing. I'm going to have to make this more of a habit coming out here before work. I hadn't really tried Little Bay all that much. Didn't know, uh, didn't know there was all that many fish out here. Turns out there are. Caught some trout, caught some redfish, even caught an oyster. So, you know, good day on the water. Can't beat it. I appreciate you following along. If you like what you saw, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. If you do subscribe, hit that notification button so you know when I post new videos. I appreciate each and every one of you. Y'all get out there and live the good life. Thanks a lot.